feel like we barely got the tech things. I I, I did promise a robot. Can can we talk about a robot? Um, you're, you're building a robot? Or no, 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 no. I'm not building a robot. That's silly, Chilla. Jeez. It would um, be awesome. Chilla, uh, can you, uh, if you can go to the bottom, the last one, this Ido uh, uh, situation, this Ido robot. Again, I really, I really want you to see this video. And I'm hoping, I'm hoping this works out well. So we, we looked at this robot before. Like, it's, it, it, it's, it's supposed to be a super friendly robot. It was a Kickstarter program. And um, I think they are doing actually pre-orders for this thing. It's called Ido. It's the it's the friendly and smart home robot, right? And uh, it was like this little kind of thing. And now they have a big version that's actually kind of tall and looks like a looks like a giant uh, 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 toothpick or uh, water pick uh, or something. And it's it's got all of the uh, it's got all the specs for it right now. Uh, so this is like. Jeez, it, there's so much to it. Um, I, I'm just going to play the video for you guys with us, and we can kind of go with uh, what's happening here. Chilla, if you can also kind of take a peek at that video as we're going. Um, so there's so there's this robot, and it looks like he's probably about three foot three foot tall, called Ido, and um, and and he's walking around. And he's got eyes. He's got a little screen that 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 that's displays information. And it's got th- these these eyes that kind of float and stare into your soul. Um, and, and here's if you're on video with me right now, you're about to see the creepiest part. It also watches you while you're sleeping, apparently. Um, <laughs> you know, so it can display the weather as soon as you wake up, along with the along with the stuff. It's got an HD multimedia projector, so it can just shoot the information to the wall uh, in, in your bedroom again after it's been watching you all night sleeping, um, and show you the news for the morning or a Facebook feed or, or as it's showing here. Like again, it, it's this. I, I'm trying to figure out how much of this is um um concept video that is actually going to happen i'm not sure uh but uh it's 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 a pretty interesting concept and it gets in here like there's a certain point where this thing like 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 peeps from around the corner and and that's starting to weird me out a little bit um and i i i don't know this is watching you while you're playing in the snow apparently (laughs) <laughs> it looks so sad looking out the window what is this and then we go into terminator mode and it's recognizing objects um i, I and i was saying if you if you take the terminator music to this i think it, it would work out really well um it takes care of your kids because you're an absentee parent um it uh <laughs> isn't that what everyone wants anymore <laughs> though i mean it's rosy it's rosy the robot <laughs> completely uh well, it, i don't i don't know so it, it, it does it kind of can you take it apart and kind of make it in half? Because it looks like at the one point it's sitting on the counter projecting down onto a cutting board, mm-hmm. like a recipe and whatnot, but it's not at full height. So it must kind of be modular as well. Side note, did it just open the door for those grandparents? <laughs> it's like R2-D2 on steroids. It, it kind of is. It's, it's, I don't know. I want this to be a real thing. But I kind of don't want it to be a real thing. <laughs> um, the kid's hugging it. The kid, the kid, the kid is hugging the robot. We we need like a robot sensitivity thing. And I've seen X Machina. I know how this ends. Okay. Oh man! Wow. Uh, no, no. It, it does look like the top part is detachable. So because I, I think the thing we were looking at before when they were doing the Kickstarter campaign was was that kind of half half version um and it's just like far far too pleasant music when they're when they're uh, going about this um robot give me a wrench <laughs> Jeez. uh but anyways it, what's it, the point of having a, a robot if you still have to fix the uh, garbage disposal he has no appendages yet he opened the door that I, know, I don't know right about. i'm not sure about that part oh here's that creepy part hold on a second i gotta show you this part um he's playing apparently they're playing ball and he's just like Hold on. They're playing the piano, and he's playing hide and seek. Whoop! <laughs> yeah, yeah. The so eyes are creepy. That's Ido. Yeah. It's 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 um the 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 next web article says Ido is pretty much the robot they promised everyone back in the 1950s. Here's the thing, though. Okay. I see what you're saying about this robot taking the place of parents, but really, is that such a bad thing for a lot of parents in true. today's world? That is true. If that's I mean, the one I, that you I went can to get. The, the art museum, and they destroyed part of the exhibit to put in a playpen for kids so parents don't have to watch their kids. Parents don't want to watch their kids, and then we get 
the degenerates that we do get. So maybe this robot will help solve some of these problems. If, if the robot's there, the robot's attentive, maybe the robot can now start teaching morals and values or, or something. And, and maybe we'll actually have kids with parents in the house. Parental replacement unit. Yes, uh, says Alex it, in the it, chat room. It, they're already gone. So I mean, you know, maybe this will, maybe so, this will be a so good thing. It, did you t- go ahead? Did you scroll down and look at the specs? No, not entirely. I saw like an ARM seven chip or something is in there, right? So it has a quad. So here's where I'm going to question the price, right? Now I'm going to I'm going to try to read this as quick as possible because okay. I know we're running late. But uh, uh, one quad core CPU, ARM seven based with a gig. Gig of RAM and 32 gig micro SD card with a second second CPU running another quad core ARM seven um, with another gig of RAM mm-hmm. a third CPU with a dual core A23 one and a half gigahertz processor with 512 mega RAM three GPUs Wi-Fi Bluetooth five USB ports. It has every protocol under the sun. Oh, no, 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 no. I just, I just imagine this thing rolling around with just like USB <laughs> dongles kind of hanging out of it all day. It has, it has three. No, I'm sorry. It has four built-in cameras uh-huh. integrated: five megapixel, one megapixel, and then two half megapixel cameras. It has two, not one, two DLP LED projectors. It has a seven-inch touchscreen, and it runs. Um, Android and Linux. Mm-hmm. Like, I can't. I'm, what? Did, how much is this thing? Well, the early bird that sold out was four ninety nine on Indiegogo. Uh, this <laughs> is shipping in October of this year, according to the the article. Uh, you can also get a developer early edition for five ninety nine. You can get uh, the premium pack for nine forty. All this plus shipping. Um, you can get ten of them in an academic bundle for t- for uh, forty eight hundred dollars. Uh, and again, it's through Indiegogo, but it, it, you know, again, it's kind of they're funded. It's happening. You know what I mean? Four hundred seventy-six percent of their seventy-five thousand dollar goal to do this, and, and that's the thing. When we first looked at it, it seemed to be like I thought a lot of this was theory, like robotic theory and robotic AI theory, right? But apparently, apparently, that's not the case. Um, and apparently that it's assimilated itself into a family, according to this photo. Um, <laughs> but uh, yeah, no, it's 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 uh, there. You go. Um, I if it works, okay. I I mean, I feel like I feel like you guys see the video recently of the robot fails, like where where like you know, it's just like robots trying to walk and they like, oh, fall yes. over. Mm-hmm. Or then there's that one where the guy kept like knocking the one like knocking stuff out of the one's hands with the hockey stick. Um, that guy's gonna get robot murdered, absolutely. Um, I'm just waiting for the Ido fail videos in probably about <laughs> oh eight months, maybe if I'm, my count is right. What if Ido just gets sick of watching you and catering to your every need, and he just uh, uh, flips switch, like a I fuse said. goes, and he just goes ballistic, and maybe he starts uh using that uh that hologram technology of his, to, uh, you know, maybe he takes videos of of you know grandpa doing something Listen, i've seen this movie before we've all seen yes. this movie before we know how it ends we know we know how all <laughs> of this is going to end uh uh time travel on john connor uh well i was gonna i um I, I, x machine is really on the top of my head but uh really creepy uh conversations and somebody's gonna try to have sex with the robot and it's just gonna go bad 